Hey guys, uh, we're back, and I am very fortunate uh, to have a good friend, Mandy, with us today. Um, we've been doing these series of interviews uh, around uh, people's experiences at Insight, and I, I am very happy to have Mandy on here to for her to share her experience with us. Uh, Mandy, again... I can't tell you how much I appreciate you coming on and, and taking the time out of your very busy day uh, to, to talk about this. Um, I know it's going to be very impactful for me. Um, I'm sure it's going to be impactful for anybody that watches this. Um, but before we really get into you know, what Insight you know, did for you and how you experienced it, tell us, tell us a little bit about yourself, if you don't mind. Um, I am, let's see. Ah. Uh. I am <laughs> I am ever the learner. I want to learn about myself. I want to learn about everything that's out there. Um, a good day is when, when I learn something new. Um, I am a mom of three boys. Uh, they're 27, 21, and 15. Um, I'm a single mom. And... Um, And uh, I am a business owner. I have an accounting firm, and um, and I I am branching out uh, into other fields um, in the next year. I'm gonna um, start uh, another business with um, uh, massage therapy. Okay. So. That's amazing. So in in the course of your journey that you've been on, what, what brought you to Entre and what brought you to Insight? Um, Jeff Lerner brought me to Entre on YouTube um, in January of 22. Um, his videos kept popping up and popping up and popping up. And, um, and yeah, I, 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 he jiggled the line just right. And I, I, bought it hook line and singer <laughs> um and so i started into the affiliate program and i had a really nice very nice specialist that um as we were talking um he suggested insight multiple times and then gave me some information and um and so uh that was the the catalyst to get me to start it into insight well, and so he gave you some information. Was it enough information to really understand what insight was once you got in there? No, no. So um, it wasn't what you expected? Um, it was more than what I expected, actually. And every person I talked to, four or five people that had been to insight, and I'm like, so what is it? And they're like, you just have to experience it. There's nothing that I can say that can that can qualify or quantify what happened. You have to experience it. So let's, let's go there then. So, you know, you've jumped on board hook, line and sinker with Jeff and crew. Uh, you know, your specialist has, has given this information about insight says, you know, it's probably a, something that you're going to get a lot out of. If you go, you get there. What's what happens? Oh man. Um, I got there a day early because coming from Washington state to Colorado, there weren't any flights coming in that day until much later. And so I actually showed up a day early and, um, and I watched all these people from all over show up. <laughs> and, and at one point I was sitting there, I think I just remembered his name. I was sitting there and I was doing my affiliate, um, uh, modules. And Frazier, I can't remember his first name. <laughs> uh, I can't remember his first it's name. Okay. Anyway, he walks, he walks through and I'm like, you're, and I said his name. Why? And I'm feeling really bad because I can't remember his name. Um, but he walked by and he's like, yeah, that's me. I'm like, this is so cool. I said, look, I turned my laptop. I'm like, you're on my screen. And, and, um, then we chatted for a little while and then he went on to do his thing. He was, um, he was one of the volunteers for, for that insight. 
And as these people keep coming in, there were so many personalities, but it was like, um, I don't know, it was like super chill, but it was like, there was this air of expectancy. Um, and so, um, I don't know, it was just, it was really cool. And I, I need to back up a little bit. Um, in, in my life, I had a huge change in November the previous year. And um, so I found that I needed to work on me. And so in March, I started some self-work. And it was a 12-week program. And the culmination of my self-work, the 12th week landed on my weekend at Insight. So it's like everything that I had done, everything that that I worked on myself to get me to that point. It was like I had to be where I was, otherwise it wouldn't have impacted me like it did. So that's yeah, amazing. That was like, and um, so when you were you, you mentioned something a second ago, <clears throat> this air of expectation that mm -hmm. everybody seemed to have had. What I mean. Was there an idea of around what that expectation was? Um, for me, I knew that that there was going to be a change, but I didn't know what it was or what it was going to look like. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna go into this organ grinder <laughs> in <laughs> in in one shape, and we're gonna come out another. Essentially, exactly. it's just a matter of, of the process to get there. And mm -hmm. in going through the process, I mean, was it basically what you had expected in terms of the, not necessarily the specifics of the activities, but in general, the activities that, that we went through, were those things that, you know, you had done before? Are they things that were completely new? Um, you know, I I know that having gone through uh, you know, certain, you know, mental health strategies in the past, you know, I, I walked in thinking, okay, this is, uh, number one, I don't know what to think. It's tied to my business, or at least, uh, you know, I, I think it is. It turns into something completely different by the end of it, which I absolutely needed and just didn't know that that's what was going to come out of it. But it, it was, we were doing things that, were so different, so so outside the norm of what you would expect in in one of these atmospheres. I mean, was that how it was for you? Um, actually, yeah. Now that you now that you say it, when I was arriving, I was thinking it was something to teach me to be a better business owner. I mean, specifically, just a better business owner. Right. And and it was like not not only did it make me a better business owner. But the reason I'm a better business owner is because it made me a better me. I mean, it went rather than just focusing on this one little facet of me, it like it was working on my roots. I mean, it was just like and and in the sessions, I haven't experienced any of the the activities that that we participated in. And but that being said, if if I had gone somewhere else and had different activities, I don't know that I would have come out as changed as, as I am. I mean, they were, they were lined up perfectly. It was, it, it's, and sometimes it was like, what are we doing? Like what, <laughs> like, I'm not connecting the dots guys. What's, what's going on here. And then you get the aha moment at the right. end. It's yes. like, Oh, yeah. Oh, you know, and it just, mm -hmm. it, it completely, you know, kind of, I don't want to say rewires your brain, but it, it definitely gives you a different perspective. And oh. that was one of the, at least for me, one of the things that I took away was not just a different perspective, but a, a, a means by which to apply that perspective to the world when I got out of there. Mm -hmm. Have you been able to apply any of those things to, to your life having come out? Um, my perspective of myself, how I see myself, <laughs> is the thing that changed the most. Um, while I was there, 
I was reacquainted with my my root person, myself at five, the one that laughed, danced, sang, <sighs> and and showed emotion all the time. Um, not before I was so was subdued and and embarrassed when an emotion would come up that I wasn't in control of. Um, <laughs> and see, like right now, I don't care that I'm crying because it's it's part of me. It's part of my expression. When in one of the sessions, when I met my myself, it was so freeing. And it was to to get back to that that little girl that wasn't ashamed of anything. It was I can't when we came out, I was dancing and twirling and like acting like I was five. And I talked to everybody that that I that that I came in contact with before that session. I I was I was shy. I was quiet. I was like hiding. And that's not the person that met you. I mean, (laughs) (laughs) Um, so the person that arrived in me is different from the person that left insight. So do you think that if somebody had told you a year ago that in a year you're going to be this version of you would you you know would you have believed them what would you have said to somebody that (sighs) man i don't i don't recognize the person that i was and if i was if i was that person a year ago looking at me now um yeah she has my skin she has my face but other than that, um, two di- totally different people. And I'd, I don't know that a year ago, if somebody would have told me that I would have been who I am now, I wouldn't have believed them because this version of me is so superior to what I was. I, I had to go through a lot to get here. And most people do. I mean, look, I'll, I'll be the first one to say that I've been carrying a lot of baggage over the years and having gone through insight, and it sounds like it was very similar for you. You just, you're able to finally kind of let go of it mm-hmm. and move on from it and, you know, see, see your future in a completely different light and maybe see it in the light for the first time in a long time. And yes. that was, I I completely resonate with where you're coming from with, with not being able to, not being able to convince old you <laughs> that there is a version of you that's going to be so much better a year from now. Um, mm-hmm. That's, that, that's incredible. So that being said, how would you necessarily qualify somebody that could potentially benefit from going and having an inside experience. You know, what, you know, what, are there trigger words that you look for? Are there, you know, is who in your mind needs to go to insight? Um, in my mind, every person I talk to, um, as far as a trigger word, um, if someone says that they are unhappy with their life or they're unhappy with themselves, that then that to me is like, Oh, I have something that you'd be interested. Um, but the reason I say everybody is because especially my, my, my family, I, I want them to experience something like this and to find that self, self expectant, self acceptance. Um, Cause that is, that is one of my things. And, and my baggage, I forgave myself. I mean, like I actually forgave myself so I could drop the baggage because I, I held it against myself. 
Um, but man, yeah, if somebody says that they're unhappy with who they are, that's because you can at insight, you find you can meet that true self. Well, I will say this. I am very glad that you went to Insight because had you not, you and I wouldn't have met at Impact. That's correct. And guys, I can't I can't tell you what an absolute pleasure it was uh, to to go through that particular experience uh, with Mandy and and the rest of uh, Community Four. We it's this this these whole events, all three of these events, are some of the most transformative work that you can ever do for yourself um and and that's not hyperbole and i think that the more opportunities you give yourself to either listen to these interviews with these people that have gone to insight or just had sidebar conversations you know with with the people that you do see in there reach out to them if you want more context we're not going to tell you what happens can't do that can't nope. let the cat out of the bag. But by all means, you know, if you have questions, reach out because we, uh, all of us that have gone through these, I, I, I would say with no exception, all believe that everyone on this planet could benefit from, from these events. And mm -hmm. if this is just one small step that you take for yourself that leads to a completely new world for you, why not take it? Why not take that chance? Mandy, I can't tell you how much I appreciate you coming on and sharing your story with me today. Um, I, I know the audience here uh, is, is going to take a lot away from it. Um, it's always great to have more than one perspective. I'm sure they get tired of me waxing poetic about how wonderful insight was. Well, it's kind of a love hate relationship, but either way, coming out of it, absolutely <laughs> in love with the person that, that you become. Um, if there's anything that I can do for you, please let me know. I'm always here for, for my compatriots in the events. Uh, and guys, I, she's, what can I, there's nothing more really to say other than get your ass to insight. Yes. <laughs> yes. Andy, thank you so much. You have a good one. Okay. All right. Thanks, Matt.